Cabo, just going back to where you started the season when you were doing kind of media day, how did this change? How did your opinion on the organization change and how the season unfolded? Um, well, I didn't know the organization that well. Um, and obviously after being here now for, uh, you know, for a season, uh, it's an incredible organization. The thing that they were able to accomplish, that we were able to accomplish this season, I think is a uh, speak volume on the, on the d direction of the team, where, where the team is going. Um, how how committed the players are and the coaches and 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 everybody you know from the um, organization standpoint and uh, you know it's it's just a great place to be and and obviously you know uh, after um, a season like that with going to the second round of the playoff I think everybody's uh, very positive about what's what's what the future holds. Uh, could you just give us an update on on your rehab and, and will that. Uh Will you be able to get a full summer of, of work, or what? What are kind of your plans sticking around mm -hmm. here? Or are you going back to Switzerland? Or where are you going this summer? What? Yeah. So, tell us everything about your life. <laughs> so first, the, the 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 injury update. I guess it's a. Uh, I've been three three and a half months now um, out of surgery, and I'm I'm getting slowly back on the court. You know, being able to uh, kind of get back into some shooting motion, a uh, <coughs> little bit of jogging and running. So probably another month before I can. Um, do more and 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 kind of uh, prepare for a regular summer um as far as training and uh in about 2 to 3 weeks probably I'm going to be going back to uh back to Switzerland for for some time taking the family back and uh and and spending most of the summer there and then come back um, hopefully and 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 start working with the team again uh, Tabo as a veteran in in this league and having just watched closely uh, the Houston series <laughs> How close or how far away are the Jazz from that level? Um, it's 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 a it's a good question. I think you know we were we were really close. I think every game you know could have went. Uh, I mean most games. <laughs> Obviously we had some some a, a few there that kind of slipped away, uh, but I think in, in the competitiveness and and what we were able to accomplish, I think it, it shows that. We are an elite team at this point, and uh, you know, we with so many young guys. You know, not only Donovan, because I mean, obviously, there's a lot of spotlight on Donovan and what he was able to accomplish. But a guy like Royce, um, even Rudy, you know, you know, in a way, and um, you know, Dante coming back and providing something in the playoff, and hopefully, you know, him getting healthy and and, and coming back. So I think the talent level is there. Uh, like I said earlier, the commitment is there from everybody. So you know, with with um, an extra summer, um, us working together, and and and, and another season. I think you know um, we, we we definitely uh, have a chance to uh, to compete with the with the top team in this in this league. Tabo, being a stopper in this league, looking at what Donovan was able to accomplish this year offensively, why is he such a difficult mm -hmm. mark for a defender? There's so many reasons. Um, I mean, the skill level uh, is up there. You know, I, I was I was a teammate with Derrick Rose when he was a rookie. Um, Russell and KD when they were young in in uh, first first you know two season in OKC, um, and and the talent level is 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 right up there with the, with those guys. You know, so um, and he's 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 fearless, relentless. He goes and and have a incredible uh, uh, confidence in his in his ability. Um, and I mean, he's just a good overall basketball player. And I mean, I'm 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 surprised that he was able to to show it this early. But the thing that he shows, even in the summer, us getting ready and at practice and everything. I mean, he's he, he's going to be great for for years to come. In your career, have you seen anyone take a big step forward shooting the ball this deep into their career the way Ricky Rubio did? Um. I mean, he he he. Uh, you know, he works extremely hard. I think confidence in this in this league, you know, in sports in general, uh, is probably sixty to seventy percent. And you know, I think he, he speaks volume on 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 the freedom that the coach gives him as well. You know, just being in that situation where he felt like you know him scoring the ball and 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 playing his game was something that the team needed, and he just stepped up, you know, and, and, and was able to provide that. He's working extremely hard, you know, every day with the coaches and, and working on his jump shot, and he shows uh, in a game, you know. So um, he's, he's, he's a good player. I think he, he always had that in him. Um, obviously, you know, he's been working on it, but I think just the confidence level um, took a huge uh, step up. 
Council questions? Is there some uncertainty with you just with the contract situation? I mean, what what's that like going into this summer for mm -hmm. you? Yeah, there's definitely a little little uncertainty. You know, you never know. I mean, um, you know, it's a it's a it's a league I've been around for some years, and there's nothing that's written in stone. You know, so I think you know I I, I love the year that I had here. Uh, unfortunately, the obviously the injury, you know, is something that you know I can't control. But you know, I I, I wish you know it had happened in another way. So. Um, you know, I would love to come back and, and be able to, to have a full season and help the guy, especially, you know, uh, in a playoff situation and things like this. And, and I think it's a great fit for me. Um, again, you know, I was really happy here and, and hopefully I'll come back. But those are decisions that I can make. Uh, but I'm pretty confident. Okay. Uh, All right. Thank you very much. Thank you.